Let's talk about three signs that show you you're not accountable. It combines the power of the mind with the wisdom of your heart and it just helps you to unlock your potential. Hey everyone, welcome to my Shiny Minds show. Hello everyone, my name is Shiny Burju Sal. I am the proud creator of NeuroShine Technology and ICF certified coach trainer, a licensed NLP trainer and ICF certified coach. Today I would love to talk to you about accountability. What is it? And how do you know if you're not accountable? Let's start by explaining what accountability is. When you look up the meaning, accountability is an obligation or willingness to take responsibility or to account for one's actions. It is really the ultimate level of responsibility. Taking ownership of your actions inactions, language, and its consequences. So when you have accountability, you're going to show up differently. You're going to take responsibility and you're going to learn from those consequences and you're going to improve them. But there are also signs that you are not accountable and here they are. Number one, you don't keep your promises. You tell people that you're going to do something and then you change your mind and you go, ah, oh, sorry, couldn't, can't, won't, will not. <laughs> so basically you find an excuse and as a pattern, you don't keep your promises. I am not discounting the fact that there will be some exceptions, right? There will be a really valid reason why you won't be able to deliver that promise at times. But if it is a pattern for you, if you keep on telling people that you're going to do something and if you don't, it's a big sign that you're not accountable. Number two is you feel attacked. When people hold you accountable, when they ask you, why didn't you do this? Why didn't you keep your promise? You feel attacked. Why? Because you're not ready to take responsibility. So instead, what you do, you find excuses and you put the blame on the things, but not on yourself. Or you justify your behaviors and you start defending yourself. And that also comes from the reason why you feel attacked. Number three is lack of maturity. How are you going to know that you lack maturity? Well, it is very similar to not taking responsibility. When you are not mature, when you lack maturity, the way you use your words, the way you talk to other people, especially when you're not ready to take responsibility, it's going to sound like you're insulting. It's going to sound like you're offending or you're defending and you're not ready to take the responsibility. You're definitely going to act like a little kid and you are not ready to grow from that feedback. And when people call you out on your mistakes, you are not saying that, oh, you know what? You are right. I should have done a better job. That is maturity. What you do instead is, no, you know what? This, things happened and because of that, I couldn't do it. It's because of this person's or what they said. You're just going to lack maturity and that is going to show up as you lacking accountability. So there you have it. Three signs that you are not accountable. Now that you know these three signs, I'm truly hoping that you're going to become more aware and you are going to improve your level of accountability. Because at the end of the day, accountability is there for you to take more responsibility of your thoughts, language, and actions. And that way you can create a higher quality of life and you can enjoy a life that is full of joy, wisdom, success, and happiness. So I hope this video helped you. I hope you liked it. If you like it, please like it and share it with your friends so that they can also become more accountable. And of course, subscribe to my channel for more awesome content just like this so that you can maximize your potential. And together, you and I, we can create a much better world with more love and shiny minds.